Hey guys, welcome back to some more Tennis World Tour and part 44 of our career mode in today's episode. We are attempting to come back from two sets to love down against John Isner in the second round of Wimbledon. He played very, very well in the last episode and hopefully we can turn it around. We're losing 6-3, 6-2. After breaking him in the very first game of the match, it looked like it might be another easiest match, easy-ish match for us. But it's been anything but. And John Isner has just defended incredibly. You know, this rally is pretty much an epitome or microcosm of the match, if you like. And there you go. He's won the point. I mean, we were absolutely battering him from the baseline but as soon as we hit one short shot he takes control of the rally and his volleying has been amazing it's been very very tough indeed yep yeah, that's all right Hits the line. Oh, so does that. <laughs> well, finally, we managed to break his defense. That was insane. Watch this shot here. There you go. Like that. That was tough. Yeah, we needed that. And finally, we hold serve. We're ahead in this set now. 1 0. Yep, good start. Frustrating to say the least. Fifteen all. Oh, that's a big mistake. I wasn't expecting that. It really wasn't. Fifteen thirty here. And this could be a huge moment at the start of this third set. Just about staying here. Ah! Come on. Oh, it's wide. Oh, I thought it was just going to loop in there. But it did just bounce wide, and we have got a break point. What a huge chance this is. Try to take our chance. Probably we're trying just a bit too hard there. Oh. You have to throw the ball Again. Advantage. Good shot from him, and it's the thing, he's fending off break points like there's no tomorrow. The only time we've broken was the very first game of the match. We have had break points since then. We had Love 40 at one point, but. He just keeps coming back. One all. At least we're not a breakdown. At least we can just concentrate on our own game, but again. Just missing elementary shots. What a shot from him. 
Oh, I thought we hadn't hit that well enough, but we just about did. It was a nice little drop approach. And we got away with it. And again, again he gets there, and again he hits the line, and again we have the goods. Just. Just about holding it together here. Mm. Oh! <laughs> oh, dear me. Come on. Oh, what a return. There's nothing you can do about that. Now we're in huge trouble because he's he's in the rally here. And there you go. We miss it. And this is his big chance. Break point. shot here just hit the line but he manages to get it back and it's just very hard work after being 40-15 up and being an inch from the line and hitting a winner one hour breakdown against the serve we haven't broken for three sets Oh, Wimbledon could be coming to an end sooner rather than later. That's a great shot, though. Fifteen, oh. Come on. the thing if you chip it to him he's just gonna create his own power so we need to just keep pummeling him really this is a chance we've got two chances here two chances come on what a serve what a serve we managed to get back. He has oh. to be aggressive. I just can't believe how good that serve was. Yeah, we can't see it unfortunately, but it just hits the line, it's so high and wide. How are you meant to play against that? And again that's wide. It's so frustrating. You work up these opportunities and then he's just able to swat it away with his serve. Oh. Another two break opportunities have gone begging. And now, another must hold. Again, another fantastic serve. Uh, sorry, return. Oh, it hits the line. Wow. This could be the end right here that you're witnessing, guys. Love 30. 
Oh, he's playing hot dog shots now. He is so confident, and we need to zap it out of him. But how do you do that when he's just whacking everything back to you but that? That was a good rally for us. That was a huge, huge point to win. Yes! Boy, that was tight. Yes! From Love 30, back to 40-30. And now... A chance to hold, which we haven't had for a long time, apart from the first game of this set, of course. <laughs> yes! We've done it. It was a, a weak return, a bit of a weak shot from us, but it was placed well enough and we have held serve and just prolong our chances a little longer. Gotta do something on his serve and fast. But it's just playing so well. He's he's playing with confidence and he's got us on the back foot. That's the problem. The serve is giving him such a big advantage. Chance here. And he just comes back with just as much bite as we gave him. And look at this. I mean, two of the points we dominated and, and we found ourselves 40 love down. I'm just having to get him so far out. Not um, far from being the best back in on the circuit. 15. No, we just need it. Oh. A real lesson in how to serve. Keep going, but four two. Now another must hold. Oh, for goodness sake! He really does. How is he doing that? Love fifteen. We had that point. Unbelievable. It's a good serve. What an ace. Great serve. He's being really aggressive right now. But the end is very much nigh here. 15.30 again. I just feel like one of these times John Isner is going to take his opportunity or we're going to miss. Two wow. Points. He's in a real bind now. <sighs> Two virtual match points here. I don't see how we're going to come back from two breaks down and that's why like well after 45 minutes of pretty tough match tennis John Esner is going to be serving for a place in the quarterfinals and he's just been the better player today He's just hitting everything. We're three points from defeat here. What a serve. But maybe we're not finished yet. Again. Managed to just about stay in the point somehow. Where is he? Where's he gonna hit it? No! 
shot what a shot and now two match points well we've saved one of them we save another oh that stupid drop shot Ah, oh, well, John Isner has won in straight sets and we're out. And you have to say, we've been absolutely dominated there. It's just unfortunate the way it's happened. We've hit the same amount of winners. I've hit so many unforced errors compared to him and only one of our ten break points taken. And that is the big difference. He took six of his seven and you know that that is huge that much pressure on you and i mean we broke the first game of the match and didn't break since we had a little 40 in one of the games and and couldn't break there and, and his serve was just on form 98 percent first serve we had 88 percent first serve it just we just couldn't find a way past him and his defence was brilliant and we're out of the tournament. It's as simple as that, really. You know, there's not much I can say. We've got some uh, a new grip there, but we go into August and um, we have some big thing and to do. We're up to number 17 in the world rankings, which is quite good. Um, I'm assuming John Isner didn't go on and win that tournament. Um, Probably went out in the quarters or semis. Roger Federer looking like maybe he didn't win that. I'm, I'm not sure. Maybe Zverev won it. Uh, it's difficult to tell. I wish you could you could see the rest of the tournament as it played out. But definitely some major thinking to do. And, and as we go into the Paris Major in the next episode, we're going to have to improve our form a lot. That was disappointing to say the least but if you have enjoyed this episode then make sure you do leave a like down below it really does help me out it means a lot to me as well subscribe if you'd like to see more and i hope you guys are having a wonderful day thanks for watching and goodbye